how much does your MCAT score matter? The MCAT is vitally important. It's designed to test your scientific knowledge and critical thinking abilities under pressure. Admissions committees value it as a hard metric to gauge whether you can handle the rigors of medical school. But the MCAT is just one piece of a much larger puzzle. Your GPA, extracurricular activities, personal statement, letters of recommendation, application narrative, and interviews all play crucial roles in painting a complete picture of who you are as an applicant. It's completely possible to get into medical school with a lower MCAT score. If you're determined to become a doctor, there are schools that place less emphasis on MCAT scores and more on other aspects of your application, such as your personal story, perseverance, and community involvement. In fact, there are MD medical schools with median MCAT scores as low as 506, 505, and even 504. And these are only median scores, meaning many students who were accepted scored even lower and still received that coveted acceptance letter. A lower MCAT score doesn't mean you'll be a bad med student or doctor, but keep in mind, this isn't the last test or major exam you'll take. Medical school is filled with high-stakes exams, culminating in the USMLE step exams, which are full-day marathons that make the MCAT look like a warm-up. If you hope to succeed in med school and get into a competitive residency program, you'll need to make some serious changes to your study habits and test-taking strategies. 